To get started, I just added a video clip to my timeline where I'd like to automatically track and blur my subject's face. Now I'm going to go over to the effects panel and add Gaussian blur to my clip, but keep in mind that automatic motion tracking will work the same for all effects that allow it. Over in effect controls, make sure your time marker is positioned where you want to start masking and then scroll down to the effect you added. Underneath it, click on one of these masking shapes. I'm blurring a face, so I'll just use a circle. Position your mask over your subject and use the handles to fit it properly. Then click the play button next to mask path to automatically track your subject. Okay, now that I have my mask following my subject, I'm just going to increase the blur amount to blur the mask. Now this looks quite good, but if you need to make manual adjustments, just stop the video where needed and move the mask around a little to adjust it. I'm also going to increase my mask feather a little bit so my mask looks less rigid. One last thing to keep in mind is that if you deselect the mask at any point and want to make adjustments later on, just reselect it here to show it in the playback window. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.